argue all the time. I'm just trying to pick the battles. Some days they come, they come at you. You just, you just gotta let them go. You just let them go and follow them to whatever dumb they want to do. Last minute picnic, we have a picnic. You bring the good bank and you. <laughs> then other days you just, you just gotta get your hand up. You just gotta just create this perimeter or something and to bounce off like. Bam. <laughs> <laughs> no, they're relentless. They never stop, and there's no reason for them to stop. You know why? Because because you can't hit them. That's what it is. Think about that. There's no physical ramifications for being an ass when you're a woman. Do you know how much of a how much of a dick I would be if it was socially unacceptable to kick the out of me? Crashing everybody I saw. <laughs> See some big muscle bound guy. Hey, I got a chin. Slap his protein <laughs> But I can't do that, right? Every guy has a line, and if I cross the line, I get blasted in the face. Totally acceptable, right? <laughs> but with women, there's no line. They can just keep <laughs> coming at you. Dude, they can do stuff worthy of like a suplex, and they'll just stare right next to it. They don't even have the decency to run away. They're like, light your clothes on fire. They're like, ta-da, I did that. <laughs> oh, yeah. And I was so proud of my work, I stuck around to see your reaction. I invited a couple of friends to heckle you as you tried to stomp it out with your bare feet. Oh, yeah, they'll, like, key your car, sign their name. Susan did this. <laughs> you sit like, now, can I at least put her in a headlock? Give her a couple of... <laughs> And that you, you never get to feel that. You guys should should do it to each other, you know? Just every once in a while. <laughs> just haul off and just blast one of your friends in the face, you know? It's good for you. You want to act like guys? Do it. <laughs>